There is, quote, another white dome, end quote, in Annapolis tonight. While keeping his sense of humor, Governor Larry Hogan is sporting a new look following two rounds of chemotherapy. WJZ's live political reporter Pat Warren on how the governor is approaching this change. Pat? That's right, Vic. After the initial shock of it, Larry Hogan looks to the positive. It comes as no surprise the governor mentioned it the day he announced his diagnosis. Uh, most likely I'm going to lose my hair. You won't have these beautiful gray locks. <laughs> and now that it has actually happened in typical Larry Hogan fashion, Maryland's governor finds a way to pull it off. Posting on Facebook, it looks like there is another white dome in the Annapolis State House, referring to the dome the state government works under. Thanks to my treatments, I'm sporting a new aerodynamic look. I'm saving time not having to wash or comb my hair, and I don't even need to shave my face. But for cancer patients in general, hair loss can be tough to take. Women especially are very conscious of their appearance. Carol Stover volunteers in the American Cancer Society Look Good, Feel Better programs. So when Governor Hogan writes, the first lady says I'm still sexy, she chuckles. I love it. I think that's wonderful. It, cancer is such a, it's such a deeply personal experience for everybody that goes through it. And he's a public figure, so he's making his personal experience and his personal journey with this available to all of us, which I think is kind of brave. I may be losing hair follicles, says the governor, but I'm winning the battle as we kill cancer cells like crazy. So yes, the new look is a bit of a shock first, but to me, bald is beautiful. That's a smart thing for him to do for his attitude and his health and your outlook and how you feel has everything to do with your health. The American Cancer Society's Look Good, Feel Better program is free to cancer patients at facilities throughout the state. And the American Cancer Society is also looking for more volunteers like Carol, beauticians, stylists, people who can melt, help make other people look good and feel better. I'm Pat Warren reporting live now back to you, Vic. Okay, Pat, next time you see the governor, tell him I said, welcome to the club. <laughs> I'll do that. <laughs> governor Hogan is being treated that. for non-Hodgkin's lymphoma. He was diagnosed in June.